<laughs> hey guys, we're back for another adventure. Uh, today is a gray and overcast kind of day, so uh, I think we'll just go ahead and maybe give our hand at some fishing today. So we've come up to Aurelia, Ontario, and put the CDU in here, and we're gonna go check out uh, just some locations around here and uh, see what we can find. So uh, just a real quick, simple one today. Hopefully we'll catch some fish because that would make it even better, but knowing my luck, uh, <laughs> very unlikely, but we'll see. So uh, like I said, today we're just gonna hang around the uh, Aurelia area uh, and just see what we can come up with. So I uh, hope you come along for this one and uh, we'll see what we get going. So let's, uh, let's get going. All right guys, so that was the Narrows that we just passed through and now we've come out onto Lake Kuchiching. So we're gonna do some exploring of this lake right now because we've really never explored this one. We've only ever passed through it while doing the Trent Severn Waterway. And we're gonna try and do a little fishing on it as well. I got my buddy from Due Diligence Fishing right there. Hello, sir. Oh, he waved! The sad, terrible, lame joke continues. Anyways guys, like I said, it's a bit of an overcast day, so not the best for going out and exploring but a, a good day for fishing so we're gonna give it a try and see what kind of luck I have and he'll probably catch like 10 fish because that's what he does so anyways let's go explore Lake Kuchichin Well, the rain is coming. Didn't see that coming, or well, we should have. So we're just taking a little, I'm hiding under a dang tree. So it shouldn't be long. And then we'll get back out there and do it. But the joys of mother nature in the spring. All right guys, well the rain has passed. We are about to hit the water again. Well, we're already on the water, so that doesn't matter. But uh, yeah, I'm gonna keep going. Uh, up Lake Kuchiching here and see what we're gonna find and get some fishing in hopefully. So let's get going again. So basically this is just a full out bird island. It's not very big, it's just this dirt pile in the middle of the lake, but look at all these comrades. Holy moly, look at them all. They have destroyed this island. Like all their nests are up there. They're all chilling out in the nest. We don't wanna go ripping past here because They'll all start taking off. Ooh, oh, oh, I'm getting a whiff of the island now. Oh my God. <laughs> oh, that, oh, that is a, that's a ripe smell. God, I'm not gonna lie. Oh gosh. It's like dead fish and bird poop. Oh gosh. Oh my goodness. <coughs> mm. Well, not an island I would stay on, that's for sure. Oh my gosh. Look at them all. Seagulls. All these things. This tree kind of still has leaves on it. Trent Severn waterway that goes out towards Georgian Bay. So uh, 
this is where you would enter into it and uh, go from there. So from here all the way out to Sparrow Lake is a 10 kilometer zone. So that's that really slow stretch for a, quite a bit of travel. So anyways, we reached the end of where we're gonna go. We're gonna start finding a spot to fish and we'll go from there. So made it this far. Oh, got one. <laughs> I just threw it in. Oh, there it is. Oh, it. Come here. First cast of the day. Oh. Okay, that was on film. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I have that on film. I wow. saw that one. First cast, huh? I literally cast in here. <laughs> Holy! That was a good one. It wasn't as big as that one you caught, but. Not bad, bro. Not bad. I better uh, get at it. Well, guys, I don't even know if I got footage of that. I hope I did. I kind of scrambled, but I literally, on my first cast, I caught a pike. Now, it jumped off right at the end, so it eh, doesn't really count as landing it but hopefully there's video of that. Um, so that's success. <laughs> one cast, one fish. I mean, I could be done with that, but we're gonna keep going and see what we can get up to. Oh, wow. All right, well, not quite the biggest fish in the world. Man, this guy went for it. He took the bait hard. I mean, that's the tiniest little fish, but it's a fish. Hey, nobody. Huh? All right. You got some. Be a fish. Be a fish. Be a fish. Be a fish. <laughs> Come on, baby. Be another one, baby. Be another one. That's gonna work. Oh god. He's too big for my net. Stay. Ah, there we go, eh, hey, bud? Is that on the Gilia? Peps. Look at that bad boy. Look at that. There you go. Not bad, eh? Not at all. Alright, let's go. 
Well, let's get this guy back in the water. There he goes. All right, guys, well, slight update here. The wind is dramatically picked up. There's this now mist out in the air and I am freezing cold. So I've found this little island and I'm gonna just hide behind here for a bit and see if I can warm myself up. So that's the, the update we're at right now. So I'll keep you posted. Like I said, I think we're gonna call this soon. And try to make our way back without getting soaking wet, so. Guys, I don't know if you're gonna hear me because of the wind. And if not, I'm sorry. I'm just gonna move in. But the wind is dramatically picked up. We're now hugging the north shore of Lake Simcoe just to try to keep it a little bit calm because man, this lake gets rough in like two seconds. It's incredible. So we're gonna stick along the north shore and then once we get near Kevin Phelps Bay, we're gonna cut over and go south and call it a day because uh, uh, this wind is just brutal. Man, it's like misty and freezing cold, so. goodness guys that was some of the most intense waves that we've had to deal with lake simcoe man what a i tell you this lake if i was to like people are gonna get on me for this one if i was to, it's one of the worst lakes for how waves can bank on they're just so sharp waves there's no rollers they just bang 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 holy moly well that was intense <laughs> from another adventure uh, I don't know that was just crazy went from you know calm waters to absolutely rough waters caught some fish so I mean, that was a good day on the water uh, so thanks so much for coming along I hope you stuck through the video I uh, appreciate you for checking out these videos thank you for all the likes thank you for everyone that's been subscribing oh look at that and the Sun comes out as I'm doing my outro. not for long so anyways guys 
while I have this brief moment of sunshine. Thank you again for everything. You guys are awesome. Stick around for more adventures coming soon. And until then, be safe out on the water. Have a great time. Peace. So that was the narrows there that we just passed through. So it's like the gap between Lake Bank. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, that is, oh my gosh. I will learn to speak. That's called the Narrows back there, so that's the little uh, gap you gotta run through between Lake Simcoe and Kevin. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna start laughing now. Back check me. Shit. <laughs> 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 All right, stop. Take six. Shush, no, quiet. <laughs> but, I don't know if you're gonna be able to see it on my bike. Dedicated, due diligence fishing, out there in the worst conditions, fishing what a hero all right guys so that was us passing through the narrows uh now what we're doing <laughs> what, what are you laughing at the way you did that you just decided to turn it no i'm doing away. this as a pan into me <laughs> but it's the way you went there i know